Graduation is off for Elmira College this weekend. It's going to happen this Sunday at First Arena. The event was in question for a short time after First Arena ran into an issue with code enforcement. Now the issue has uh, turned a bit of a political battle, so we're going to continue to cover that event right now. Joining us now, Enforcer's owner, a Pioneer's owner, and Robbie Nichols. Robbie, thanks for joining us. How does this all go down for you? Well, it was kind of a surprise for me. Um, we. I've been working with code enforcement John McCracken. Uh, I had a great conversation with him and Fire Chief Martino and uh, Richard Keyes came over and we did a walk through through the building. A long time ago they came through, we had 13 violations in the building. We've been pecking away at it. Mm -hmm. The last time they came through, we were down to five or six. We mm -hmm. worked on that, we're down to three. So the gentleman came through and looked and we made a plan, what dates everything's gonna get fixed and they're fine with it. And, that was the end of the day. The next day, I found out that Mo uh, Sheriff Moss, Chris Moss, put out a media advisory to all the media places, mm -hmm. didn't send it to me, didn't mm -hmm. send it to my lawyer, and uh, put out a thing that we had all these yeah. violations, 13 violations, which ca caught me off guard. Yeah, and uh, were these violations prior to <laughs> your... your it, it just blows my mind away, and it should blow the public's mind away, how there was 13 violations when they handed me the building. The mm. county ran the building, mm. and the county had 13 violations against himself. I'm a guy that wants to move forward and yeah. fix it, and it uh -huh. has to be a safe building for all. I want that. I'm in the building. My grandchildren are in the building. Yeah. Um, so it has to be safe. That's key. And are you planning to meet with uh, anybody from the county? That's funny that you said that, because I want to meet with the county all the time. I email a lot back and mm. forth. Um, no one from the county has reached out to me. Mm -hmm. um, you know, some of them... I've had no good conversations. Yeah, so Anytime the county so calls me, they want to come inspect the building or look okay. at the roof or do something. When the enforcers had a great season, First Arena had a great season, Mayor Dan, Mal, Dan Mandel yeah. reached out to me and congratulated the county. Nothing, no mm. help. Okay. Um, another thing he failed to mention is my wife and I have put 130000 over 130000 of our own personal money in that was supposed to be paid back. And today, to this day, we have not got one cent back. All right, so this is still a, an ongoing battle, and we'll see how it is on its side. They're telling me i got to go, but real quick, it's going to be an exciting night at least. we got the Pioneers opening night. You can take a deep breath and enjoy the fireworks, right? Fireworks All opening right. night, go piles. All right, well, thank you for that. Thanks for stopping by. We appreciate it. Of course, we'll continue to follow the story.